you're watching Carl B. Gideon and Gabino Diaz Lawn Care Service Daily Vlog. Let's go. Enjoy. All right. Good Saturday afternoon, folks. It's about 1230 Saturday afternoon. Sunny sunshine, Florida, what we should be having. Hey, listen, I want to tell you a story about this past Monday. Most of you who follow my vlog, you've heard me say I Uber sometimes on Friday and Saturday nights for extra money for take vacations and stuff. Well, this past Monday, as you've been following my vlogs, it was piss-ass pouring. It rained all day Monday and Tuesday. So Monday, I told the wife I'm going to go out and go Ubering. You know, because money's coming in from a lawn care company, but I'm not going to sit home and do nothing all day. So I got to Uber on Monday about 7.30 in the morning. And about 1 o'clock, I get a call. Go pick up this lady, you know, whatever. So I go to this place. She's not there. I wait a few minutes. I text her. She didn't come out. I call. She goes, oh, I'm not there. I'm at this address. Can you come get me? I'm like, we'll cancel this Uber ride. Re-Uber it. I'll come looking for you. Or I'll come pick you up. So she did that. I get there. Downpour rain. I mean, rain where you can't see across the street hardly. So we, uh, I'm sitting in the middle of the street because I didn't want her to, to walk in that lake. Put her in the water. So um, while I'm sitting there, this car pulls up. Guy gets out, runs up to the house. I'm thinking, yeah, I'll be running too. It's hard as it's raining. Well, he starts kicking on the door. Big, muscular, African-American guy. I'm thinking, oh, great. I'm like, why is he kicking the door? Did she lock him out or something? I don't know. But he runs around back. Well, my rider, the Uber rider, comes running out of the house. Jumps in the car and says, go. That's my ex-boyfriend. Don't let him hurt me. Great. What I get myself into? No big deal. We go down. We make a right. We make another right. Streets flooded. And she's telling me to go. I'm having to crawl through because the water is deep. We get through there. Make a left. Make another right. We're on one of the main drags. Her boyfriend comes chase. Ex-boyfriend comes chasing us. She says, oh my God, don't let him catch me. He's going to hurt me. I'm like, where you want to go? She's like, well, right now, let's get away from him. I'm like, all right, we'll figure it out. He gets close to me and gets next to me and I hear a pop. I knew what it was. It was a gunshot. Look at that. That is a glove. I put a glove in there to try to keep the water out. That was a bullet hole. It went through the car into the back seat and came out right there. She was sitting over there. It hit her in her back. Now she's shot. So I make, now I make a U-turn and trying to get away from this guy and he follows us. So anyway, we go about a mile down the road, going 80 miles an hour and a downpour of rain, trying to get away from this maniac. You know, I don't know what the hell is going on. He's bumping my bumper. Yeah, I had a real exciting Monday. And then we, uh, sorry, I'm looking for a uh, insurance stuff. We're uh, buying a new car today that we was already planning on doing. And, uh, Doot, 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 doot. so anyway we're going down the street and everything and um finally i lose him i went the wrong way on the wrong way we're going down the two lane road it comes to a fork and it splits you go right if you go left you can't go that way well we went left while she's on the phone with 911 and we ended up at the police station with a bunch of cops waiting because she was on the phone i was telling her to tell him to get out of my outside because i did not know where this crazy nut was what he's going to do, she wanted me to take her to the hospital, Bayfront Hospital. I'm thinking, no way, lady, because he'll probably gun both of us down, because now I'm a witness to this. I'm not getting shot. So that was my Monday. And, of course, Tuesday, it rained all day. I didn't go out Uber on Tuesday. One, I had blood in the back seat. Two, the wife was taking my child and a friend of his to the movie, so we had to cover the back seat up with a big blanket. Tuesday evening, my buddy Mike from Rise and Shine Auto Detailing cleaned the seat up. No blood. Detailed inside of the car. Uber is going to reimburse me for that. And I said, well, we've been talking about trading the car in. It's a good time. So now we're here at a Honda of Pinellas Park in Florida. And we're Crown Honda. We're trading the car in. She's getting a Honda Pilot used car, but it only has like that many miles on it. The guy just wanted uh it was a lease option, took good care of it. So we're trading this car in. She told me if I get a bullet hole in this one from Uber, she's gonna kill me. I hope she was joking. 
So that's how I'm spending my Saturday. So I wanted to get that vlog up. I did mention it a couple times about vlogging about my Monday. So that's my interesting story on this past Monday. So no grass cutting. And I decided to go out and get shot at. Yeah, let's not do that again. So that's the story about my crazy Monday. Getting shot at, trying to make some extra money so we can go on vacations and stuff. Crazy world. Thanks for watching. I'll put a vlog up later about the new vehicle we're using. Not many miles on it. Good trade in. And it also has a trail hitch. So in case I have to use it, in case my truck breaks down like it did last week, I want to go run a U-Haul. But shh, let's not tell the wife I want to do that. She wouldn't like that. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next vlog.